Buju Bantan's first U.S. show set for New York, USA. Ladies and gentlemen, greetings, greetings, and salutations to all nations. Ladies and gentlemen, you know it's your favorite Jamaica. I'm Rastafari, so the here people's TV. Thanks for tuning in to the Rastaman channel. If you have not subscribed as yet, family and friends, hit that red subscribe button. Become a part of the Rastaman panel. Pujo Banton is getting ready for his first show in the United States in well over a decade. The reggae legend announced his long walk to freedom. New York show set for Saturday, July 13. Run, go get your ticket. The concert, which is his first show on U.S. soil in 13 years, will take place at the UBS Arena in Queens, New York. The singer was recently in New York where he was welcomed with open arms by Buster Rams who saluted him for his contribution to the culture. In a press release set to Urban Island, Butchu Banton shared that his show will mark a joyous occasion for him as he looked to celebrate his life and freedom with his families and friends and longtime supporters. I give thanks for life every day. But on this weekend, there is a special Thanksgiving and i looking forward to celebrating with all my families and friends, everyone who has prayed and support me over the years. The singer said, Buju will also be celebrating his 51st birthday two days after the show on July 15th when he is hosting a private event in the U.S. with families and friends including DJ Khalid who used his private jet to fly the Jamaican singer from Kingston to Miami earlier in the month. Buju Bantan last performance in the United States is Before Dawn concert in Miami January 16, 2011 which saw him perform in front of a sold out crowd before his conviction and subsequently 10 year prison sentence for drug trafficking. Buju last show in New York was 2008 at Madison Square Garden. The wannabe love singer real name Mark Marley was released from prison in December 2018 and deported to Jamaica. He has not yet been back to the United States until May of 2024 following the tragic passing of one of his sons, Miles Myrie, who died in April of 2024. Now the show has garnered so much attention and so much request, ladies and gentlemen. Bujo Bantan has added a second day for his New York concert due to the popular demand Reggae dance all star Buju Banton giving New York fans another chance to see him live due to the popular demand. A second date has been added to his long walk to Freedom New York concert at the UBS Arena in Queens. The second show will be held Sunday, July 14. Just one day after the original scheduled July 13 performance. With the first show selling out in record time, the addition for the second show ensure that more fans and music lovers will be having the opportunity to witness the legendary artist come back. A release on Dance Hall magazine stated, Long Walk to Freedom, New York, exemplary Buddhist Bantan, realizing that he is serving the beacon of hope for the fans around the world. Buju Bantan will be supported by the Till Shiloh Band, while David Le Levy will host the event with music by Bobby Conders and Jabba. Now, the UBS Arena, an indoor venue that opened in 2021, seats up to 19,000 people for a concert. Banton will also celebrate his 51st birthday, ladies and gentlemen, and this is a great time for Bujo Banton. And I just wanted to come on the internet here and you know big up the gargamel fans for sticking with bujo banton all these years i know it has been a long walk to freedom and with you know great reggae fans such as bujo have there will be no no question that his long walk to freedom will be successful ladies and gentlemen i'm rastafari soldier here of deep roots tv reporting that ma myrie 
Buju Bantan. Gargamel, the voice of Jamaica, will be performing live July 13th and July 14th because of a popular demand for the ticket at the UBS Arena in Queens, New York, USA. A more life me I said to Bojo. A more life me I said to the fans. A more nappiness. If you think you're going to make it to the Bojo concert, you know, I would like if you could, you know, send me some clips. Big up yourself because I'm not really in the New York area at this time. So I don't foresee myself making it. But I had I'm going to say full joy on yourself, ladies and gentlemen, because Buju has been waiting for this moment. More life and more joy and more happiness. Big up on yourself, friends and families. In, yeah.